Throughout Thailand, 7-Eleven is one of the most popular stores. They seem to be on every street, only a short walk away from wherever you are. So we're stopping in to buy regional Thai snacks to see if they're just as good as the food we've eaten on the streets and in restaurants. We paid 281 baht for this, which is about eight or nine dollars. We can't wait to dig in and see how good everything tastes. I'm gonna get some seaweed. I don't know what the difference is between the green, the blue, and the red. Wonder if the red is spicy. I'm gonna try that one. It's only a seven or six bot. That's even better. Oh, it is spicy. I am so excited for this spicy seaweed. I feel like this is gonna be my favorite. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. Oh, this is the best. Oh my gosh. It's spicy? spicy. Well, like really spicy? No, it just is for like a second spicy. And it's not that spicy anymore. Okay, there it is. It's the kick. You gotta wait for it. It's like thicker. It's like almost like seaweed bread. That's what it is. It's kind of like really thin bread with like seaweed. Yeah, it like has little little like ridges on it. Yeah. I don't know if it, you can see that in the camera. Yeah, I think you can see that. I really like it. What do you think this is? Dessert of some kind? It says it's a bakery item. Ooh, I wanna get blueberry cheesecake. Blueberry cheesecake. It looks like it's 29. I'm super excited for this one. It looks like it has a graham cracker crust. Probably need a fork, but I'm just gonna eat it with my hand. We do have a fork. I can go grab it. It's okay. It looks good. Mmm. Are you sure you want some? Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> A nice little tiny cheesecake. Oh, I love it. That's so good. The crust makes it good. It's like really, really soft on top, and the mm. crust is a little bit crunchy. Mm. We need to get another one of those. I am like borderline hangry, so like getting all this food is really fun. Yeah, maybe not the best decision to wait until we're so hungry to start buying food, but that's what we're doing. What are we feeling here? I know we're getting some kind of drink. Yeah, I want to try something that's Thai, but I can't decide what. I'm gonna get this little peach flavored soda. Let's try this. I think it's a soda. It's maybe. I don't know. We'll see when I open it. It's the peach one, right? Yeah. It does look Ooh, like there's it's some fizzy. Yeah. It looks on the outside the can. It looks like there's some carbonation. That's what they're trying to portray there. Huh. Yeah. It tastes like a peach soda. Okay. Soda. It's very soda. refreshing. Very sweet. I think I like it. Not a big fan of soda, but. It's not as like fizzy as like a Coke, but it's definitely got a little fizz, but not super amount. Oh, it says mixed yogurt drink fermented by Lactobus. Okay. So it's a mixed yogurt, but it's also fizzy? We can get these ones. They look like French fries. Should we get them? Okay. Nori seaweed, seafood twist, or truffle. Those are all the ones we found that are unique to Thailand, or at least we can't find them in the United States. Oh, what do we got there? Grilled seafood and spicy sauce. And do you think those are good? <laughs> I don't know. I kind of want to get the Tom Yum. Yeah, let's get the let's get the Tom Yum ones. Okay. I mean, that was really good when we had it on our food tour. I'm really excited for this shrimp Tom Yum hot pot flavor chips. Those look good. It's gonna be interesting. We had Tom Yum in our other food tour. It was with shrimp. It was delicious. Oh, whoa. Uh, that's interesting. Yeah. It's a good flavor. It kind of really does taste like shrimp. And it, it tastes like that lemon, like the mm, citrusy flavor yes. that was in the liquid. That's what it, it's like the lemongrass. Wow, they really nailed this. It really does taste it like tastes, the soup we had. Yeah, it really does. It's so lemony. And like ginger too, like a little bit of ginger. I'm usually not a big fan of ginger, but that, that works for me. Tom Yum is delicious. I get the broad beans with chili flavor. Let's do that. What's a broad bean? <laughs> I guess we have to try it. Uh, do you know what broad beans? Oh, there's chilies chili on flavor. it. Chili flavor. Oh. Chili flavor. Okay, so they're gonna be spicy. I hope they're really spicy. Okay, let's do it at the same time. Okay. They're like, they're they flat. Like flat? Like half peanuts, maybe? Okay, so are we just trying one? Yeah. 
Yeah, they're pretty flat. Ooh. Good crunch. Good crunch on they're that. They're like airy. Like it's not, oh. Oh. That aftertaste is weird. Hmm. I'm gonna have to eat a few more to see if I Yeah, I feel like, like I need like a handful. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pour a lot. It almost tastes like seafood okay. after. Let's see? It's really not spicy. No, it's not spicy. I like the texture. It's not like solid. It's like airy and crunchy and crispy. Getting a sandwich to eat. I got spinach ham cheese Danish sandwich. Okay. I think I just gotta go with the crab stick and nori because it's different. Looks good so far. Ooh. Okay, it's just one big sandwich there. Mmm, big That's fan. Good. The 7-Eleven actually asked us if we wanted this heated up but it was kind of a walk and we had to like shower and everything. We decided to eat it cold. Mmm. Big fan. I That's like good. that. I'm gonna eat. Mmm. You have your sandwich. I want that one though. Ham, cheese, spinach. Really good. Oh my gosh. Delicious. The croissant is like so buttery and flaky. I feel like I'm in France right now. This one is the crab stick and nori double croissant and it definitely smells like seafood as soon as you open it oh wow so, so it doesn't really look like anything it just you just see the croissant but i guess you just take a bite is it good i like the other one better this smells very strong i'm gonna take a little bite Hmm. it's sweeter than i expected it, it, it's really sweet i just don't think i'm in the mood for crab right now yeah it's like crab and mayonnaise almost with a croissant yeah. it's not bad but yeah, you have to be in the mood for like seafood for it. 7-Eleven also has a hot food section which you can heat up your food. Maybe one of 7-Eleven's best treats is these grilled cheese sandwiches. Oh, they're so good. I also really like the dumplings. Mmm, love it. They have big gulps even in Thailand. They have ice too. And let's see, should we get Prawn crackers? Oh, yeah. They're 10. No, green pea. Green pea. Okay, these, yeah, I think I'll like these better. Green pea, a little tiny bag of them. Green pea snack. I think I'm gonna like these. Yeah, these are gonna be good. As long as they're salty enough. They're a little bit harder than I was expecting. Okay. Yeah, it's not like a nice clean crunch. They're like kind of hard. But the flavor is really good. The flavor is good and it's not even like too salty. I was expecting it to need to be salty for it to taste amazing, but. This counts as eating vegetables, right? Oh, it's really good. I'm yeah. a big fan of that. It looks like we're in the cracker aisle now and I'm seeing a lot of these price tags and they're like five baht, six baht, that's like, I don't know, like 10 cents in the United States. So for sure gonna get at least one of these. These chocolate filled crackers look good. Ooh, okay. <laughs> we have to get these yeah, ones, right? Yeah, that looks really good. I was about to put it back because I didn't know if I wanted it anymore. Jenny said she wanted it, so we're gonna try it. These look like I would love them. So I'm gonna grab that. Let's try some of this dessert. Oh. Is that everything? Oh, uh -huh. that's only half of it in the package. Hmm. Mm. These were like very affordable. It had, yeah, it's like a wafer. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. A chocolate wafer. There's chocolate on the outside and on the inside. Big reason why we got them. That's good. The texture is really nice too. Here's the wafer. This one is uh, really messy. Well, I didn't open it correctly, but here we go. A lot of crunch. Okay. Oh. It, it is different. It is much different than the one we just had. It's not very sweet. I was expecting it to be like more chocolatey. I like this one though, because it has lots of layers, so it's like fun to bite into. Mm -hmm. We're going to get these. Sticko fingers. There's not that much in here, but this reminds me of a snack in the United States that I really like, so we're gonna get it. Okay, what have we liked so far? These Tom Yum chips, obviously. I mean, these are amazing. These are some of the best stuff. It's from Lay's, so. It's all been pretty mm. good. I think I liked the beans the least. I, I really like yeah. the peas. Yeah. And the, I don't know, the ham and cheese sandwich is pretty good. Yeah, I'm really glad I got that one. <laughs> all right, let's try the ones, the Sticko Fingers. Sticko Fingers. Oh! 
They're really tiny. Mm. Really tiny. Mmm. They're good. Filled with chocolate. Yeah. Uh -huh. Chocolate. The outside crunchy. Very soft and crunchy. Yeah, it's like a nice little snack. It almost is like the peas. <laughs> but chocolate flavored. I'm just gonna keep eating them. Yeah, they're they're easy to munch on. The coating is very light. There's also like bread and donuts you can get here. There's a lot of other options that we're not going to get. There's also like raincoats. Gotta get this chocolate filled bun. I am so excited for this one. Chocolate custard filled bun. Oh, it looks so good. Whoa, okay. Oh, it already smells good. I bet it's gonna taste like a chocolate croissant. It kind of just looks like you would put a ham and cheese sandwich in there. But there's chocolate. Oh my gosh, look at that. Whoa, it's heavy. Oh my it gosh. It's heavy. That is the best thing I've ever tasted. Mmm. I love it so much. It's like a sweet bread roll. Mm-hmm. But it's thick. And the bread is like really soft. I'm not gonna let Jacob eat any more of it. <laughs> I'm gonna save that for me. Okay, I honestly think my favorite was the peas. The peas were so solid and they were only like 10 baht. Oh, we Amazing. need to get more of those. The Tom Yum chips. I mean, those were expensive, but very good. Mm -hmm. But then like, the, of course the value, I think, might be in the peas. The peas. The seaweed. The, the seaweed. The spicy seaweed, also very solid. Yeah. Nice, easy snack, but it won't fill you up. Look at us. We're going for the vegetables. The all natural <laughs> fried stuff. Wow, we're so good. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to watch our full Thailand Bangkok food tour, we'll put that here. But if you want to watch a similar video to this one, we did a Finland snack tour just like this. So here that will be. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you next video.